Hello, I'm Robert Nichols from Boston Trust Realty Group, and today I want to talk about exit strategies when it comes to real estate investing, and specifically when it comes to flipping houses. So anytime you're looking at evaluating a deal and seeing if the, the deal makes sense as far as flipping it, everything looks fantastic on paper, we're going to make a lot of money, you know, you're very optimistic about what the income potential is going to be on a particular deal. However, you have to account for what if things go wrong. And so anytime you look at engaging in a flip, you want to have your best case scenario and that's selling for maximum profit after the project's done. Second best case scenario, selling it as is. If you have to you know, wholesale, you may have to refinance. And worst case scenario is basically just getting rid of it as quickly as possible as things go south. So basically, whenever you start the process of, of doing a flip, you always want to have your exit strategy at the forefront of your mind to account for any unforeseen circumstances. So even if you know part of your exit strategy is you know uh, getting additional capital to do the project, you want to make sure you have every type of scenario covered that you can possibly think of so that you set yourself up for success when it comes to engaging in this deal. Too many times I'll see investors go into a flip and you know they'll be banking on the number one exit strategy, which is selling for maximum profit after the work is done. But let's say the property has tenants, you can't get them out. Now what are you gonna do? You know, you want to clearly identify what your strategy is gonna be when things happen that are out of your control. So to recap, you know, the top three exit strategies are, from my my perspective, based on when I do a flip, is first, renovate the property, sell it for maximum value. Second, look to refinance it if it's taking longer than it needs to take. If I have a loan, a short-term loan on it, I'm going to have to refi and get something more long-term. And third, just liquidation, selling it for as-is value to pay off my lender, maybe make a couple dollars, maybe not, but at least it'll allow you to move on from a bad situation, a toxic situation as soon as possible if you see there's no other way to get it done or if you don't have uh, additional capital that you can tap into to continue to carry the, the project. So. Exit strategies are your best friend when it comes to doing flips. I'm Rob Nichols, and I hope you found this information helpful. Have a fantastic day.